while Brian Maroney, Chief Bridge Engineer for Caltrans, grew up in America's heartland, Peoria, Illinois, he has spent his adult life working in earthquake-prone California, most notably on seismic retrofit of the Golden State's bridges. I started working for California Department of Transportation in uh, 1983. Finished my master's at uh, Colorado State and drove out in a Mustang with my bicycle and uh, stereo and box of clothes. He brought along dedication and enthusiasm. So learned a lot about design, learned a lot about construction in the real world, um, worked in earthquake engineering, and then uh, had an opportunity to um, you know, start, start dealing with things like the Whittier earthquake, Loma Prieta earthquake, Northridge earthquake, um, Petrolia earthquake. The 1989 Loma Prieta earthquake changed his life. The night of the quake, a fire captain drafted Brian Maroney to help in the rescue operation at the Nimitz Freeway. And when I was in there with them, I saw, I saw, um, I saw some uh, hard things. And that's always been a drive, a drive for me. You know, you go through a couple of earthquakes and you see how hard a community is hit, how hard the people are hit. And it, it gives you, it gives you uh, the opportunity for a purpose when you go to work. Brian Maroney oversaw the seismic work on the Bay Bridge, the Dumbarton Bridge, and the Antioch Bridge, along with safety improvements at structures all over the state. Brian's contributions to transportation in the Bay Area are, are going to be felt for generations. Brian has really led the charge uh, on making sure that the structures we all rely on, those structures are safe and sound. I think his work uh, to, uh, and his service to the state of California has been outstanding. When Brian speaks, uh, it, it is obvious uh, that uh, he knows what he's talking about and that integrity shines through. I'm ecstatic that he's winning the award. You couldn't choose a more deserving person than Brian Maroney. It means a lot to me to see somebody who's dedicated his life being recognized this way.